I'm Dan from Green Cube. Just wanted to give you a short introduction to our range of tents, which includes the unique Roof Cube. Roof Cube is specifically designed for your attics or lofts, as well as basements. It's 1.8 meters high. It has a 42 degree angle on both sides, meaning that it will fit in 90% of the lofts around the UK. There's three different sizes available. This is the 1.2 by 1.2. We have a 1.5 by 1.5 and also a 1224, which is 1.2 by 2.4 meters. Okay, moving on, I'd like to talk about the materials which we use now. We get a lot of questions here about the denier which we use, which is 210 Oxford denier. Um, most people now are going to the 600 and everybody asking us, oh, why aren't you got 600? It's better. Just wanted to explain to you why we spend the extra money on the 210 Oxford denier material. First of all, the weave on the 210 is much, much tighter. This not only eliminates lap pin pricks where the weave actually separates, whereas this um, 210 denier it's much tighter and stops that. It also, when you've got a, a loose weave, which the 600 is, it also lets the smells out of the tent, the heat out of the tent, and it's just a generally a poorer, cheaper material. So we like to use Gore-Tex versus woolen examples. Wool is a thicker, like the cheaper tents, but has a looser weave. Whereas Gore-Tex is a high-performance, tight, lighter weave, like our 210 Denier Oxford material. Coming along on with our material, we have X-Reflect Diamond Cut Mela. This is specifically designed for our range of roof cube and green cube tents. If you look closer, you'll see the embossed dome diamonds. This reflects the light evenly when the light hits it. So if you should imagine that you have a dome here, when the light hits it, it is reflected throughout the tent evenly and creates less hot spots. Okay, I want to run you through the poles first of all. These are steel poles which are powder coated with our unique green color. They are 25 mil wide and more importantly, one mil thick. The easy click connectors on the inside, all the corners are metal, and they hold up to 100 kilograms. Roof cubes and the green cube have a lot of access door panels. The main access door panels all have hooks, meaning that you can open it up and easily tie your doors out of the way while you work on inside your tent. Moving on to our zips now. We spent a lot of time and effort in this particular department because we needed to get it right, and we have. So these are 10 gauge military style waterproof zips. The reason why they're waterproof and why you should check other manufacturers is that we spend a lot more extra money getting the rubber black backing on the back of our um, zipped. This means that when they uh, zip together, they create a tight seal. Whereas the nylon back in like this, when it gets pushed up against another bit of line, nylon, gets folded over. We use extra thick stitching on all our zips, making it the seams super strong. And we have, which is quite unique to our um, green cube, is double zips meaning that we've got a zip pull on the outside and a zip pull on the inside. So when you go on the inside of your tent, it makes it a thousand times easier to zip yourself in, creating a seal there and creating, um, keeping your environment where you don't have to break it. Then when you want to come out, instead of putting your hands around and trying to break your arm to get out of it, just simply grab hold of the zip pull and come out. The other thing which we do is one zip. Other manufacturers tend to do the five zip solution on the front of the tent. If you wanted to look inside your tent, you'd have to do the middle zip totally, one at the top, one on the left, same down the bottom. 
just takes so much longer. With that, it's just one zip and so once you've used the one zip closed, what most manufacturers do is have no seal here and the zip goes right to the end and then when you go right to the end, it starts fraying at the edges and this is actually a weak point on it. What we've done is put the nylon here, stopping the zip going all the way to the end and hitting the weak part of it, making your tent last three times longer. Now, moving on to our unique and exclusive design registered lightsaber boxes. These are light boxes which have a 700 micron bug resistant mesh on the inside to let cool air go into the tent and keep the bugs outside. But unique to us, a uniquely designed light box lightsaber. So you put the pins on the inside, open it up, bring down the flap. What this does is soften the light which is emitted from the intake and softens it by emit, uh, deflecting it down to the ground. Okay. Moving on now to our socks. These are double socks with pull cords. Uh, we were the first people to do oversized socks for acoustic ducting. Our socks, particularly unique, is our stitch block. What happens is when you put a, a needle through a Oxford material, the needle is bigger than the thread behind it. So like memory foam, the tri-layer um, foam protector actually expands into that area, making it much, much more light protected. So another unique feature of our tents is the uplift bar. This was an original feature by us and designed for hydroponic watering systems. This allows you to have your tank on the outside and have your pipes uh, leading into your hydroponic gravity fed watering system completely horizontal to the ground. This eliminates washback and makes your system much, much more efficient. Now the uh, windows. All roof cubes and green cubes come with our new sensor windows. Not only do the windows allow you to look at your plants when your lights are on, checking temperatures without breaking the environment, the new green filter also means that you now can check on your plants when they're asleep. The green filter filters out all white lights and it means that they keep their energy and has a greater yield.